Hello, my name is Sarah. Thank you for watching this instructional video for the progesterone and oil injection. You will need the following. A vial of progesterone and oil, syringe with attached needle, 23 gauge intramuscular needle, alcohol prep wipe, gauze and a sharps container. Make sure that the vial of progesterone and oil does not contain free floating particles. Remove the cap from the vial of progesterone and oil. Wipe the top of the vial with an alcohol prep wipe. Take the syringe with attached needle out of the packaging. Hold the syringe upright and draw in the same amount of air as the dosage required. Place the needle into the rubber stopper on the vial and press down on the plunger until all the air transfers into the vial. Invert the syringe so that the vial is upside down, but still attached to the syringe. Pull the plunger until the correct dosage of medicine enters the syringe. Take the needle out of the vial and replace the cap. Twist off the needle and place in the designated sharps container. Remove the 23 gauge needle from the packaging and attach it on the syringe. Hold the needle upright and remove the cap. Do not let the needle touch anything, including your hands. While holding the needle upright, gently tap the side of the syringe until the air bubbles migrate to the top. Apply slight pressure on the plunger until a drop of liquid appears at the tip of the needle. The injection should be given in an intramuscular site specified by your physician. Wipe the injection site with an alcohol prep wipe and allow the skin to dry. Make sure to alternate the injection sites between both sides of your body. Take the syringe in your preferred hand. Stretch the skin between your fingers at the injection site and insert the injection straight into the skin. Pull back slightly on the plunger. If no blood enters the syringe, proceed with the injection. If blood does enter the syringe, remove the needle and reinsert in a nearby cleaned injection site. Push the plunger until all the medication transfers into the injection site. Gently remove the needle and apply pressure with the gauze. Dispose of the used syringe into the designated sharps container. Thank you for watching our MedEd video.